David Bay here for MuscularDevelopment.com in Vegas once again for the IFBB Olympia weekend, hanging out here at the Mutant booth with Johnny Jackson. Johnny, crazy weekend in Vegas. You had a solid year in 2016 once again. Uh, what do you got coming up next year, man? Um, at Toronto Pro, it'll be my first show next year. So uh, I think it's in May. And uh, so looking forward to that. Yep, get back into the gym and hit it hard and uh, bring it. You know what I mean? get after it. Speaking of bringing it in, uh, you know, you're always one of these guys who shows up at the shows, consistent, all that sort of stuff. But, you know, you, you're not a spring chicken Absolutely. by any means. Um, you know, we've talked a little bit before, you know, when you look at, you know, where you were at this year as far as your placings and stuff like that, and you're looking to, you know, better that for 2017, you know, right. for, for a veteran competitor, you know, what is it like going to the drawing board and trying to come up with a game plan for a following year? Man, well, the way I look at it, uh, when a new year comes in, is a chance for any one of us, you know, as a pro, to make it big, you know, to break into that, you know, realm where you got that, you know, um, reputation of every time you show up, you're going to be in the top three at least, you know. So, uh, like I said, uh, every new year I look at it like that. Um, being older, you know what I mean, it is what it is. Uh, everybody knows things, you don't recover as fast. You know what I mean? You got to be a little bit smarter with your training. You got to know when to back off and give your body some rest. So uh, as long as I'm smart, I think I'll be okay for the next day. You know, next year is my last year on stage, you know, so I officially say that. And um, you know what I mean? As long as I'm smart about it, I think I'll be okay. Yeah. Now, now rest isn't really a word that you use too much or people don't think about you too much with your training. You're known for your, your very heavy training and your powerlifting. Um, is, is that the powerlifting movements, your heavy deadlift squats and bench, is that still a regular part of your routine? Because I know some of the other guys, when they talk about getting uh, you know older, you know, sometimes they back away from that heavy stuff, but that's been a base of what you've been doing for your entire career. Yeah, no, that's, that's our style of uh, training. You know what I mean? Heavy and hard. And uh, if I'm not training like that, then I'll just stay home because it's not going to be fun for me. Um, and uh, officially, I'll say this, next year I will be doing a powerlifting meet. So I haven't done a meet in probably two to three years. So uh, it's about time to get back into it. Yeah, that was actually, you, you, you stole my next question. I was going to say, hey, man, you know, if you're away from the bodybuilding stage, would you, you know, consider getting back into powerlifting? Uh, you know, obviously a yes. And uh, you wouldn't have to diet down to 4% body fat for all that. Absolutely. Absolutely. That's why I do it. You know, um, I know uh, uh, one particular time, I think it was uh, 2004, and um, I did, I think it was a New York pro, and I came in like last, you know, 14th or 15th. So, I mean, very upsetting, you know? So what I did was go on the internet and I was like, I need to find me a power lift to meet so I could go win something. So that's when I did the Florida. There was a, the, it was a, the Florida show, the bodybuilding show, but they had a power lift to meet um, hooked up to it. So I did the power lift to meet instead of the show. And of course I did an 804 deadlift so it was a good day that's that's not not a bad day at all when you're pulling over 800 pounds well i'll tell you what man the mutant booth busy as always with johnny and the other guys here tons of fans looking for autographs and pictures so we're gonna wrap it up and let you get going yeah he's still got it he's trying i gotta i gotta angle you <laughs> they give me a hard time for angling everybody but i gotta do something right so uh but we appreciate your time uh looking forward to seeing you on stage in toronto always usually well i shouldn't say always usually first weekend in june Right. Um, but oh, uh, May this year. I, oh. out. I talked to a promoter yesterday, and I can't remember the exact day, but it's in May this uh, next year. I'm assuming it probably be the last weekend of May or, or, or somewhere around yeah, there. Yeah, absolutely. All right, man. Well, you got a little bit of time. Eat, eat some actual good food before you got to crank the diet up. Unfortunately, I got dad body going on big time right now, but that's okay. Sometimes think, you got to do that. I think your definition of dad bod and the general definition of dad bod might be it might be a little bit different but uh all right man we appreciate your time and everything like that we're gonna let you get going so guys one more time david bay with johnny jackson from the 2016 ifbb olympia weekend here in vegas